blocked by Kapanis. Another huge play. Jordan pump fakes, another three on the way. This time it goes through, and some pushing and shoving. Jessica Carter getting into it with Grace Hall. You hate to see a game like this go in the way it just went. Nice made three there by Jordan. And then obviously it's physical in the paint. Arms get tied up. Tempers are short in moments like this. Both head coaches right now acknowledging they're together. They're acknowledging not the finest moment for either staff. They'll take care of it with their staffs. That's classy on both people's part. Yeah, another look at it. This one, close angle. A little jawing between Grace Hall and Jessica Carter, perhaps. Leilani Kapanis interjecting herself. Benches for any reason. Coaches can go out to manage the situation. And you saw Muriel Page for Mississippi. Kaz Beverly, saying right at the WBIT logo. There's another look at it. Carter, three. Man, Ja'Kayla Jordan has been fun to watch tonight. She's just set her new. Not enough players practice that mid-range, find value in that mid-range. And she's a player that really does. But she extended the lead and essentially clinched the victory for Mississippi State versus TCU in a mid-range pull-up. Analytics say you're supposed to shoot threes supposed to get layups. That mid-range is not talked about or glorified nearly enough across men's and women's basketball, collegiate and professional levels. But she's a player who made two threes on the night and eight two-point field goals, a couple at the rim, but a majority of them in that mid-range. Ian Purcell and Keeger talk with the referees at midcourt, explaining the whole situation. And Tamar and I have talked about a lot to unpack in what had transpired. Again, 12.4 to go. A full game reset essentially here. Both teams at four fouls, the possession arrow points Mississippi State's way. Penn State still has three timeouts, Mississippi State with just one. Obviously at a very extended timeout right here. Both coaches being able to draw up something, talk through defensive strategy. Executing. Substitutions are coming in. Natasha Cammy has a full piece of paper with her. Full rundown from Natasha Cammy, rightfully so, for her to have a piece of paper. The three counts for Ja'Kayla Jordan. Foul against Jessica Carter and Grace Hall. They have both been disqualified from the game. Then for Penn State and Mississippi State, Ashley Wusu and Lauren Park Lane both came onto the court. They have also been disqualified. 